So when is the best time to book a flight? It's a question every traveler struggles with when it comes time to book a flight. If you book too early or too late, you could significantly overpay your fare, especially if you're booking your entire family on a trip. So in this video, I'm gonna share with you how far in advance you should book your flights in order to get the cheapest deal. Let's go. Dream vacations start here. So every year, a website by the name of CheapAir.com does an annual airfare study, and so I'm gonna be sharing the findings from that study. They looked at over 900 million domestic airfares in more than 8,000 markets across the U.S. And so we're going to be looking at answering these questions. Number one, when is the best time to buy an airline ticket on average? Number two, what are the booking zones that identify the best times to buy for each type of shopper? Number three, what are the cheapest days of the week to fly? Number four, what are the best and worst months to buy flights? And number five, when is the best time to buy flights by season? So let's start with the first question. When is the best time to buy an airline ticket? According to the study, the best time to buy an airline ticket is 76 days before your travel day. Now, this is the average time to get the best fare, so when looking for flights, be sure to start looking before this time frame. Question number two. What are the booking zones that identify the best times to buy for each type of shopper? So Cheap Air breaks the study down and goes deep into identifying the best time to buy for each type of shopper. There are pros and cons to each. So let's start out with the first type of shopper they identify, which is what they call a first dib shopper. A first dib shopper is looking to book their flight between six and a half months to 10 months before their trip. Booking this early will give you a wide range of options, including the most choice in seats, specific flight times, and even classes of services. According to the study, if you choose to buy this early, you end up spending around $30 more on average per airline ticket. The second type of shopper they identify is the peace of mind shopper. This shopper is looking to book between four months and six and a half months before the trip. If you're this type of shopper, you will save $15 on average if you book around this time frame. The next type of buyer is what Cheap Air identifies as the prime booking window. This would be between three weeks and four months. This is where you want to be if budget is the priority. And since Cheap Air has done this study, this booking window consistently offers the lowest airfare prices for travelers. The next type of shopper is identified as the plane with fire shopper. This would be buying a flight one to two weeks before your trip. If you wait this long, you're almost certain to pay more for your flight and will have fewer choices as far as seat and flight schedules go. And the last type of shopper Cheap Air identifies is the Hail Mary shopper. This is going to be if you're looking to buy a flight within a week of your trip. If you have something unexpected come up and need to book a flight at the last minute, you're going to be looking at paying around $150 more than if you booked in the prime window time frame. Let me know in the comments what type of shopper you are when it comes to buying a flight. I'm definitely a prime window buyer and maybe even a peace of mind shopper when it comes to international flights. All right, let's move on to question number three, which is what are the cheapest days of the week to fly? According to the study, the cheapest day of the week to fly in 2022 is Wednesday, with Tuesday being a close second. Flying on Wednesday will save you $57 per airline ticket versus the most expensive day to travel, which is on Sunday. On to question four, what are the best and worst months to buy airline tickets? So the worst months to buy tickets are November and December, followed by June and July. No surprise here, you have the holiday travel in November and December, followed by the peak summer travel in June and July. If you're planning a summer trip, August would be the best summer option. And then the least expensive months to fly of the year are January and February. And the last question we will answer is, what is the best time to book a flight by season? According to Cheap Air study, book 110 days in advance for the winter season, 76 days in advance for the spring season, 42 days in advance for the summer season, and 77 days in advance for the fall season. And I'll just say, as people start flying again post-COVID, and as fuel prices remain high, expect higher fares going into the summer months and for the holiday travel at the end of the year. So to save yourself money, look to book your flights in that prime booking window. So let me know, what has been your experience if you have booked flights recently? Are you experiencing sticker shock or lack of flight options? Post your experience in the comment section of this video. And let me know if you found this video helpful by liking the video and consider subscribing to see more of these type of videos. Thank you so much for watching this one. And I can't wait to see you in a future video.